Welcome to Holistic Wellness 24-7. Are you ready to discover natural remedies that actually work? In today's video, we're going beyond the basics and diving into 10 scientifically proven solutions that can help you heal, rejuvenate and thrive naturally. Our mission is to empower you with safe, effective alternatives that truly support a healthier lifestyle. But that's not all. Stick around until the end because we'll be highlighting two surprising remedies you probably haven't heard of. Whether you're looking to cleanse, revitalize or elevate your overall wellness, you're in the right place. By the end of this video, you'll have a clear, simple roadmap to improve your well-being step by step. Here at Holistic Wellness 24-7, we focus on the how-to of not just extending your lifespan, but also expanding your health span. So let's get started on your journey to better health. Ever wonder if there are natural remedies that truly work? Guess what? There are, and they're backed by science. Let's kick things off with a sweet solution for a common problem, especially during cold and flu season, the nighttime cough. You know, that annoying cough that keeps you and probably everyone else in your household up all night. Well, before you reach for that bottle of cough syrup, consider this. Honey, yes, you heard that right. Honey has been used for centuries to soothe coughs and modern science backs up this ancient remedy. Studies have shown that honey can be even more effective than some over-the-counter cough suppressants, especially in children. It works by coating and soothing the throat, reducing irritation and inflammation. You can take a spoonful of honey straight up or mix it into a warm drink like herbal tea or warm water with lemon. The warmth of the drink combined with the soothing properties of honey can work wonders for a nagging cough. But hold on, before you start dipping into that honey jar, there's a crucial safety precaution, especially for you new parents out there. Never give honey to infants under one year old. Honey can contain spores of a bacteria called Clostridium botulinum, which can be harmful to babies developing digestive systems. And next up, let's talk about sleep, or rather, the lack of it. In today's fast-paced world, getting a good night's sleep can often feel like a luxury. If you're struggling with sleep-related issues, you might be surprised to learn that a natural hormone produced by your body could be the answer melatonin. Melatonin plays a crucial role in regulating your sleep-wake cycle. It's produced by the pineal gland in your brain, and its production is triggered by darkness and inhibited by light. This natural ebb and flow of melatonin helps signal to your body when it's time to sleep and when it's time to wake up. Melatonin supplements can be helpful for people who have trouble falling asleep, staying asleep or have jet lag. However, it's essential to consult with your doctor before starting any new supplements, including melatonin. Remember, melatonin is not a magic sleep solution and it's essential to address any underlying factors that might be contributing to your sleep problems. Moving on to another common ailment, let's talk about nasal congestion. Whether it's due to a cold, allergies or a sinus infection, a stuffy nose can make you miserable. While there are plenty of over-the-counter decongestants available, a simple saline nasal spray can be just as effective, if not more so, without the potential side effects. Saline nasal sprays work by flushing out the nasal passages, removing excess mucus, irritants and allergens. This can help to reduce inflammation, relieve congestion and improve breathing. Plus, saline is gentle on the nasal passages, making it a safe option for both adults and children. Using a saline nasal spray is easy. Simply tilt your head forward slightly, insert the tip of the bottle into one nostril and gently squeeze the bottle while breathing in through your nose. Repeat on the other side. For babies and young children who can't blow their noses yet, a bulb syringe can be used to suction out excess mucus after using a saline nasal spray. Let's move on to a rather unusual remedy for a common annoyance. Hiccups. We've all been there, those involuntary spasms of the diaphragm that seem to come out of nowhere and can be surprisingly persistent. While there are countless home remedies for hiccups, from holding your breath to drinking water upside down, a spoonful of sugar might just be the most surprising and effective solution. The science behind this remedy lies in the way sugar interacts with the vagus nerve. The vagus nerve is a long cranial nerve that runs from the brain to the abdomen and it plays a role in regulating many bodily functions, including breathing and digestion. 
When you swallow a spoonful of sugar, the granules stimulate the vagus nerve, essentially resetting the nerve signaling and interrupting the spasms that cause hiccups. So the next time you're plagued by a bout of hiccups, reach for a teaspoon of sugar. Swallow it slowly and you might be surprised at how quickly those pesky hiccups subside. Now let's talk about skin health, specifically eczema. Eczema, also known as atopic dermatitis, is a chronic skin condition that causes dry, itchy and inflamed skin. While there's no cure for eczema, there are ways to manage the symptoms and find relief from the discomfort it causes. One such remedy that's been gaining popularity in recent years is colloidal oatmeal. Colloidal oatmeal is finely ground oatmeal that's been suspended in water or lotion, allowing it to be easily absorbed by the skin. It's known for its soothing and anti-inflammatory properties, making it an effective natural remedy for eczema. It forms a protective barrier on the skin, preventing moisture loss and shielding it from irritants. You can find colloidal oatmeal in various forms, including bath products, lotions and creams. For a soothing oatmeal bath, add one to two cups of colloidal oatmeal to a lukewarm bath and soak for 15 to 20 minutes. Moving on, let's discuss a natural remedy that's been used for centuries to treat burns aloe vera. Aloe vera is a succulent plant that contains a gel-like substance within its leaves. This gel is packed with vitamins, minerals and antioxidants that have anti-inflammatory, antibacterial and wound healing properties, making it an effective natural remedy for burns. When applied to a burn, aloe vera gel creates a protective barrier over the affected area, soothing the skin, reducing inflammation and preventing infection. It also helps to speed up the healing process by stimulating cell growth and reducing scarring. To use aloe vera gel for burns, simply apply a thin layer of gel directly to the affected area. For best results, use fresh aloe vera gel extracted directly from the plant's leaves. While aloe vera is generally safe for topical use, it's essential to do a patch test on a small area of your skin before applying it to a larger area. Let's face it, constipation is a topic that most people would rather avoid, but it's a common digestive issue that affects millions of people. While there are plenty of over-the-counter laxatives available, a natural remedy that's been used for centuries to relieve constipation is prunes or dried plums. Prunes are a good source of fibre, both soluble and insoluble, which adds bulk to stool and helps to move things along in the digestive tract. They also contain a natural sugar alcohol called sorbitol, which acts as an osmotic laxative, drawing water into the intestines and softening stool. To relieve constipation, it's recommended to consume 50 to 100 grams of prunes per day. However, it's important to note that prunes can have a laxative effect, so it's best to start with a small amount and gradually increase your intake as needed. Moving on to a remedy that many of us associate with childhood chickenpox, calamine lotion. This pink liquid has long been a staple in medicine cabinets for its ability to soothe itchy skin. But calamine lotion's benefits go far beyond just chickenpox relief. It's a versatile remedy that can provide relief from a variety of skin irritations, including burns, insect bites and poison ivy. The active ingredients in calamine lotion are zinc oxide and ferric oxide. Zinc oxide is known for its astringent and antiseptic properties, while ferric oxide adds a soothing effect. Together, these ingredients work to dry out oozing blisters, reduce inflammation and relieve itching. To use calamine lotion, simply shake the bottle well and apply a thin layer to the affected area with a cotton ball or soft cloth. You can reapply calamine lotion as needed, usually every few hours. Now let's shift our focus to gut health and the role of probiotics. Probiotics are live bacteria and yeasts that are beneficial for our digestive system. They help to maintain a healthy balance of gut flora, which is essential for proper digestion, nutrient absorption and immune function. One of the most well-known benefits of probiotics is their ability to prevent and treat antibiotic-associated diarrhea. Antibiotics, while effective at killing harmful bacteria, can also wipe out the beneficial bacteria in our gut, leading to digestive upset. Probiotics can help to replenish the good bacteria and restore balance to the gut flora. Probiotics are available in various forms, including supplements, 
yogurt, kefir, sauerkraut, and kimchi. When choosing a probiotic supplement, it's important to look for one that contains multiple strains of beneficial bacteria and has a high colony-forming unit count. Finally, let's end with a rather unconventional remedy that might surprise you, duct tape for wart removal. Yes, you read that right, duct tape, the versatile adhesive that's a staple in many households, has shown promise in treating warts. Warts are small, non-cancerous growths on the skin caused by the human papillomavirus. They're contagious and can spread through direct contact or contact with contaminated surfaces. The use of duct tape for wart removal is based on the principle of tape occlusion. This method involves covering the wart with a piece of duct tape for an extended period, usually several days to a week. The tape is then removed, the wart is soaked in water, and the dead skin is gently scrubbed away. While the exact mechanism by which duct tape works to remove warts is not fully understood, it's thought that the adhesive properties of the tape may irritate the wart, stimulating the immune system to attack the virus. But that's not all. Here are two more honourable mentions that you might want to keep in your Holistic Health Toolkit tea bags. Use a warm tea bag as a compress for a sty. It opens the blocked gland and aids drainage. Ginger tea versus soda. Why true ginger tea is a better option for an upset stomach compared to soda. Natural remedies not only address specific health issues but also contribute to overall well-being. From boosting immunity with herbs to promoting digestive health, Incorporating these practices into your daily routine can enhance your wellness journey. You might be wondering, are natural remedies really effective? Or are they just old wives' tales? Rest assured, these remedies are backed by research and have shown consistent results in studies and traditional practices alike. Today, we explored some of the best natural remedies that can help you manage common ailments and promote holistic health. If you found this video helpful, be sure to hit the subscribe button for more natural health tips. Don't forget to like and share this video and let us know in the comments, what's your go-to natural remedy? Hash, natural remedies, hash health tips, hash wellness journey, hash herbal medicine, hash holistic health.